Alright, we're here. First things first, we do need Peter Pan in the party. He is required. Or we can't get to this boss, so get Donald the hell out of this party. He is effectively worthless for this battle. Goofy. He's only here to be a mana battery. I don't really expect him to even help at all, except for that mana. But we're going to give him the Dream Shield for that extra mana. Oh, that's right, we also got the Genji Shield off that, um, off, what's it called, the, uh, the uh, Hades Cup, but, uh, not as good as the Defender, so who cares. So, yeah. We got the Dream Shield on for that extra mana, and we want to change up our spells a bit. Uh, I'm, I don't really need a Rogile, you're not gonna need it, but stop, ra or stop, required. You don't need Stopra, you can do it with Stop, but helps. Very much so. Because you have a little bit more extra range kind of to it. So now that we have this good, it you might want to try out having um, Square, Triangle, and X, Fairaga, Thundaga, and Blizzaga, but uh, I like this setup just because I want my go-to spells hockeyed. Because um, you have a good amount of time for everything else, but yeah, you'll see, trust me. He's not fun. He's hard if you don't follow the strategy. But he doesn't hit that bad. He just, he can effectively one-shot you. So, yeah, let's go. Welcome to the Phantom! First things first, ignore him. Ignore him completely. Once you see this clock start moving, stop it. And then focus on him. See that white ball? That means melee. That means melee attack him. When it's red, you want to shoot him with fire. And when it's white, melee. And there we go. Blue, Blizza uh, Blizzaga. Red, Viraga. Um, what's it called? Yellow, Thundaga. So yeah, bam, and, and there we go, bam, again. Watch the clock, because once it starts going again, oh wait, 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 with this, line of sight him. And bam, worthless. Wait, 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 clock moving, no, glance at it every now and then. I will nag you if you don't, trust me, you want to do it. Because if that clock does a full rotation, Peter is gone, then Goofy is gone, and then you are gone. I mean, gone forever to Neverland. Stop moving! Ugh. Stop it! Uh -huh. Bam. Alright, well. Yeah, see, we caught it. And then it's, uh, see, he doesn't have a little orb underneath him, now he does, so, yeah. He doesn't hit worth shit, in my opinion, so don't worry about that, and bam, another position. Oh, he, is he going to do it again? Oh, when he does this attack, line of sight him. It will follow you and hurt, but if you line of sight him, it does nothing. Alright, well, I'm going to stop you again just for sake. Because Goofy's uh, job in this battle is to give you mana, like how he does every now and then. Seriously, stop it. And we got another one. Peter, uh, he's not bad. He'll do some healing in that every now and then. And again, haha. See? Oh, he's gonna do it. Line of sight. You can't hurt me. Round the corner. Oh, whoops. Too soon. Or sorry, you wanna line of sight when he casts it, rather. Is this time going down again? If you see that 9 turn into an 8, immediately go stop the clock. Because that's a countdown. And I hit 0, Peter Pan's gone. So I kind of went over that already, but uh, yeah. Here. 
Did he interrupt it? Where'd he go? Oh, he's... What are you doing down there? Alright. Just keep an eye on that clock. It doesn't matter how long this fight takes, just watch him... Or sorry, watch the clock more. That's all that matters, alright. And we got another uh, rotation on it. See, he's kind of getting close to dying. He's not too bad as long as you watch the clock. If you don't watch the clock, however, you'll royally screw yourself. Bam, again. And even if you if you don't want to watch, you just stop it every now and then. So, it's not your problem. Whoops, oh crap, 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 crap. Yeah, that, that's gonna get me. Oh, that's right, I have uh, the shield on. It's better if you line of sight it, but yeah. PvPing in World of Warcraft teaches you if you don't line a sight, you're gonna have a bad time. Yeah, not taking any chances. I don't know how long stop lasts for. I don't care. I just wanna. Oh, I forgot to line a sight. It. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, got it. There we go. Bam. Surprisingly, he's he's not giving me that rough of a time. Normally, he just. Runs the hell away, and oh, Goofy's out of mana, so I'm gonna look there, Goofy. Oh, they did a whole uh, transition on their own, nice. Oh, don't give MP to Peter. Screw him. Hello, plan decided again. Get back. Stop the clock. And continue. Oh, get him. Oh, no, no. Yeah, he'll do this a lot. I mean, a lot. I've had him do that for like four minutes consecutively. And I was pissed off. <laughs> All right, well, we're getting a good deal of progress on him. He's almost down to that last HP bar. That's when we're smooth sailing. Bam. Now you know it's pretty much a win. Oh, and now line of sight. And that attack is worthless. And there we go. The clock moving, nope. How about him? Aha! I'm pretty sure I'm being pretty inefficient with the mana by doing it too soon, but honestly, I don't care. Just keep the, st the clock stopped. Last time I did this, I forgot about it, and I did it with, like, two on Sora. It was a bad time. A very bad time. There we go. Looking good. Looking good. Yeah, see? If you just fly around, you can evade his attacks real easy. Aha, one more rotation and he's done. Clock's not moving good. Oh, there it is. And line of sight. And it hits the clock, and there's no more. Stop. Oh, what the hell. Just in case. And... Whoops. One more, and he's good. If he does the melee ones a lot more, it goes by pretty quick, because, uh... We're a lot stronger in melee than magic, so he'll definitely feel it. No, don't fly around. And he's gone. We have defeated the Phantom. Yeah. After Sephiroth, a lot of these are not bad. But the Phantom, if you follow the strategy, he's not too bad. If you don't, he's pretty fucking hard. Yeah, unlike Sephiroth, he is a Heartless that escaped uh, from Hollow Bastion. And Stopra becomes Stopka. We now have the strongest spell of each spell. Look at that. Look at all the guzz. Game on. So now we want to head to Agrabah for one last boss, who's personally I suck the most against. <laughs> Just because of uh, how the encounter works. 